a beautiful tone produced by children on violins. These are students studying violin through the Suzuki method. The founder of the Suzuki method, Dr. Shinichi Suzuki, used to say over and over again that every child grows, it depends on how he is raised. Dr. Suzuki's ideas spread throughout the world, and now there are 400,000 students who study using the Suzuki method. And in March of this year, students from around the world will be coming to Matsumoto, the birthplace of the Suzuki method. In this program, we will talk with the president of the Talent Education Research Institute, Minio Nakajima, and the artistic director, Koji Toyota, to explore the appeal of the Suzuki method. This early educational method, which is now being used in 46 countries around the world, is the Suzuki method. The founder of this method, Dr. Shinichi Suzuki, observed how children learn to speak their mother tongue, Japanese, so easily and discovered the high capacity of a child's potential. Based on this, Dr. Suzuki gave birth to an early educational system through music, the Suzuki method. In 1946, in the city of Matsumoto, located in Nagano Prefecture, the Matsumoto Music School was created by Dr. Suzuki and other men of culture at that time. This was the start of the Suzuki method. Dr. Suzuki's education method that was born during the confusing time after World War II spread throughout Japan and the world. Now about 400,000 children in 46 different countries study using the Suzuki method. The Suzuki method, which overcame politics and brought countries together through music, in 1975, children studying the Suzuki method throughout the world came together in one place, and the first World Convention was held. And this year, the Suzuki method World Convention will come back to its birthplace, Matsumoto. Today I will be talking with the president of the Talent Education Research Institute, Minue Nakajima, and the artistic director, Koji Toyoda. Congratulations on having the World Convention here in Matsumoto in March. So it will be 15 years since the last conference was held here in Matsumoto, the birthplace of the Suzuki Method. Mr. Nakajima, serving as head of this conference, can you tell us your feelings about the conference? It has really been a while since we have hosted a world conference, and it is going to be the largest world convention that we have had. I am looking forward to it being a grand musical convention here in Matsumoto. We are looking at about 6,000 participants, and due to the complications with finding enough space to accommodate this large number of people, we are now having to turn down many who would like to attend. We already have over 5,000 people coming from around Japan, and we have well over 1,000 applicants from various countries overseas. Taking this into respect, I think it will be a very lively world convention. And we also have one of Dr. Suzuki's prized pupils, an artistic director, Mr. Koji Toyota, here today. The World Convention will be returning to Matsumoto after 14 years. What are your feelings? I am truly excited. As you know, the Suzuki Method has become widely accepted throughout the world and is being researched by many. So I think in that respect, this World Convention will particularly be drawing attention from the world. I see. It is going to be very exciting to have Suzuki sounds from around the world come together in Matsumoto. Yes, it will. So, Mr. Toyota, you started the violin when you were three under the tutelage of Dr. Suzuki, 
and after Dr. Suzuki passed away, you succeeded him as president of the Suzuki Method. So could you please tell us about the key points of the Suzuki Method? Well, this is a rather difficult point, but Dr. Suzuki found it shocking that Japanese people could speak the Japanese language, meaning that he was shocked by his realization of this. What I mean to say is, as you are well aware, the Japanese language is very complex. It is divided into so many different levels of hierarchy, and it is a compilation of many different cultures. So seeing how children could use this language freely as they wished, Dr. Suzuki was shocked to find that children had such talent. Then he found that if you keep researching down this path, any human can do anything. Every child can, were the words that he was led to. So there is incredible weight placed on the philosophy that every child can. This is not about things to do with society, like everyone can become the prime minister or the president. It is about each child being a respectable and cultural human being. This is the strong belief that Dr. Suzuki came to embrace, and since he was a musician himself, he tried to improve his theory by mu using music, and that is how we have come to where we are today. And Mr. Nakajima, who succeeded Mr. Toyota as president and supports the current Suzuki method, what are your thoughts on the teachings of the Suzuki method? The Suzuki method does not start with going through sheet music. You absorb the music through your ears, memorize it, and repeat it over and over again. And that is where we get the word method. Method means way of doing, which is memorization and repetition. I believe this is what is special about the Suzuki method. Today, the areas that are lacking most in Japan's education system are the cultivation of aesthetic sentiments and sensitivity, especially while a child is young. This would also be fine in elementary or junior or even senior high school, but music is something like arts and crafts that does not have to do with the entrance examinations for schools. So schools, children, and their parents tend to neglect it. Yet, aesthetic education, which nurtures artistic creativity, is most important in child's education. And I believe it, it is extremely important going into this era of globalism. With the decreasing birth rate, Japan is having a hard time right now. But the Suzuki method is really taking off throughout the world. There are about 400,000 people who are studying through the Suzuki method. I just recently got to play the violin in Carnegie Hall along with Suzuki children of the United States. And in Sydney, the Suzuki children fill the famous opera house. Europe and Asia as well have great integrity. And the fact that it was born in Matsumoto, I think, has great meaning.